Hey, what's up everybody? Let's go! Welcome to another Microphone Mondays where I post new microphone reviews and microphone comparisons every Monday. And today I'm reviewing a microphone that people have been asking me about for a while. The Fine Fine K669B, which is a USB condenser microphone. And you may notice that I'm pronouncing it as Fine Fine instead of Fine Fine. And the reason is because Fine Fine actually reached out to me one time and told me that the correct pronunciation is fine fine and not fine fine. So that's what I'm going with here. I'm assuming because this microphone is made in China that that is probably the Chinese pronunciation. And I did not get this microphone for free nor is this video sponsored. I actually bought this microphone myself just because so many people have been asking me about it so I'm finally doing a review on it. And by the way the audio that you are hearing right now is coming from the fine fine K669B. I have it right here in front of me on my desk. I'm estimating that the microphone is about seven inches away from my mouth. And in this video, I'll show you guys a quick unboxing of the microphone, then I'll do a demonstration, and then in the end, I'll give you guys my final review and thoughts on this microphone. And if you do like this video, or if it helps you out, make sure to go down there and give this video a like, that would help me out so much. And if you would like to see more videos by me in the future, make sure to go down there and hit that subscribe button and also that bell notifications button. And let's go ahead and get started by taking a look at the Amazon page. So the Fine Fine K669B goes for $29.99 comes with free shipping, and as you can see here, there are several different colors that you can choose from. And I'll go ahead and put the link to this Amazon page down in the description below in case you want to check it out for yourself. And you may notice that some of the colors are a few dollars more expensive, and you may also notice that some of the models are actually named differently, such as K669S or K669G. And that just refers to the color that you get. So S would stand for silver and G would stand for green. The microphone that I got is the black one. And now let's go ahead and do the unboxing. As you can see inside the box there is the microphone, a USB cable, a tripod desk stand, the user's guide, and then some support info. The mic itself is made out of metal and it actually has some decent weight to it. And in case you don't want to use the tripod desk stand that it comes with, you can attach the microphone to any other standard mic stand. The mic can also be angled to your desired position. And if you look at the front of the mic, there is a volume knob which can be used to adjust your mic input gain. There is no headphone jack on this microphone, so if you would like to monitor your audio, you're going to have to use software monitoring in your computer. So I think we covered just about everything, so next let's go ahead and do some different audio tests, and then after that I'll let you guys know what I think about this microphone. So the first thing I'm going to test is the noise floor, I'm going to stop talking for a few seconds and try to listen to see if you hear like an underlying hiss noise. Now this is what it sounds like when I'm tapping on my computer's keyboard directly behind the microphone. And this is what it sounds like when I'm tapping on my desk around the tripod desk stand. And this is how it sounds when I'm standing roughly 5 feet away from the microphone. Okay guys, so I just reviewed the audio that I just recorded, and I just gotta say, 
The noise floor was quite a bit louder than what I would have liked it to be, and I think the higher frequencies seem to be slightly rounded off at the top, resulting in the audio not being as bright as it could be. However, in the end, taking into consideration that this is a $30 microphone, I think it's not bad at all. If I had paid, say, $60 for this microphone, then yeah, I would have liked something that sounded a bit better, but for $30, what you get is not bad at all. And I just want to mention real quick that I did test out this microphone with an OTG adapter and my iPhone XR, and it worked, so that's also pretty cool. But anyways guys, like always, I would love to know what you guys think. Let me know down in the comments below. Do you agree with me? Do you disagree with me? Let me know down in the comments below. Once again, I will have the Amazon link for this microphone down in the description below in case you would like to check that out for yourself. And if you did like this video or if it helped you out, I would really appreciate it if you went down there and gave this video a like. That would help me out so much. And if you would like to see more videos by me in the future, make sure to go down there and hit that subscribe button and also that bell notifications button. If you would like to follow me on Instagram, I'll go ahead and put my handle right here. It's at YT underscore Tobias. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Peace.